ALCU asks Amazon to limit public use of facial recognition software. Alibaba unveils AI restaurant ordering technology. And Amazon pursues Chile and Latin America. These stories and more are coming up on this week's Lifter Cloud Roundup, Friday, May 25th. Welcome to another edition of the Cloud Roundup on LifterNews.com. I'm Shaley Webb. And I'm Corey Bowling. Let's take a look at some interesting changes in the cloud this week and how they could impact the Lifter Index. The American Civil Liberties Union sent a letter this week to Amazon CEO Jeff Bezos asking the cloud leader to limit the ways in which public entities can use its Amazon recognition technology. The letter details concerns the ACLU has about potential misuses of the software, citing the recent case study from AWS and Washington County. Amazon responded by releasing a public statement saying that the company, quote, requires that customers comply with the law and be responsible when they use AWS services. Anyone who violates this requirement could face suspension of their account. The statement goes on to say that the technology has already been utilized for a variety of admirable causes, such as locating missing children and identifying attendees of the recent royal wedding. The ACLU, along with the rest of the civil rights organizations that signed the letter, remain unconvinced. Alibaba Cloud demonstrated a new AI technology this week, allowing customers to make complicated voice orders to a kiosk and have that order be accurately displayed and fulfilled. The breakthrough for the smart kiosk comes from the Alibaba's team's research into spoken language understanding, a combination of speech and natural language processing. The kiosk has the potential to draw even more small and medium-sized businesses into the cloud arena, with potential for lower labor costs and fewer mistakes in customer service. The demo unit was complex enough to distinguish changes in a coffee shop mid-conversation, such as corrections on the number of drinks being ordered, modifications to sugar level, or if the beverage is decaf, and a tack-on addition of a to-go order. The technology only recognizes Chinese spoken language at the moment, and the consumer version of the ordering system is expected to roll out this fall for small and medium-sized enterprises. Zhi Yi Yan, head of intelligent speech interaction at Alibaba, sees the future of the speech recognition functionality not only in food service, but also for home appliances, cars, and for retail applications. Chilean President Sebastian Pinera met with an AWS representative earlier this week, and shortly after, a senior executive from Amazon announced that the company is looking to include Chile in a larger Latin American expansion plan. Both Chile and its neighboring Argentina have shown interest in drawing the attention of the cloud leader. The executive went on to say that no announcement about Amazon investment in Latin America was imminent and that Amazon would be looking for progressive, forward-thinking telecommunication industries to work with. The Chilean president has stated he hopes to position Chile as a digital and information services platform for the region, setting the stage for what could be an ideal environment for AWS infrastructure. And that's a wrap for this week's Roundup on LifterNews.com. Has your business made major strides using cloud? We want to hear from you. Email us at ideas at LifterNews.com.